So I'm here with Hank Kopf, uh, conference organizer extraordinaire. <laughs> Been dashing around as ever, always so full of energy at Stage of the Map. How are you finding it? Uh, it's always energizing. Uh, state of the maps are, uh, uh, well, I, I, I find them great. It's, uh, it's, um, it's what you see, what state of the, or, or what OpenStreetMap is, what the community is, uh, and there's so much energy there. And although it's sometimes very um, um, uh, frustrating or very tiring to actually organize it, but if you're here at the, at the conference itself, it's just so much energy uh, around it which makes uh, every time again OpenStreetMap that brilliant of a project that you have that uh, dedicated community doing all kinds of magnificent stuff. I'm certainly enjoying it myself. Okay, well, great to hear that. <laughs> Are you doing another auction at the end of the day? Uh, on, uh, probably, Sunday? probably not. No uh, auction. No, auction. No, no. Well, Something a bit different maybe? Uh, yeah, well, the auction idea, the idea behind the auction, it, it started in Amsterdam 2009, I guess. And the auction, uh, for those who don't really know it, um, uh, it was more of, uh, at the end of, of the Amsterdam conference, well, we had all kinds of stuff, uh, like banners and... Stuff and to get rid of. St stuff, stuff to get rid of. We, 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 honest, uh, we otherwise would, would basically throw it away. So we kind of thought, well, we can also sell it off, and if, and if we can get a little bit of money out of it, it's just a little bit of money for the foundation or for the uh, project. And it somehow, it turned it's into the highlight of the conference. Yes. All, all got a bit over right. the top, didn't it? And, uh, got yeah, a bit carried away with the auctions. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we basically, this year, said, well, the fun or the new kind of thing is, uh, has, gr has grown out a little bit, and we need to find something new. Something new. Yeah. All right. See, uh, we'll have to see what happens on Sunday, then. Uh, yeah. And I also have to see that because I think we're not really have it settled down what it's exactly going to be. So it's going Although to be we do, have a, we do have a hack day on Monday as well. Absolutely. So that's also one of the, I think the first day that, that we also now have a uh, follow-up day being a hack day. Uh, because it's, uh, and it's good to have it the day after because all that uh, energy, but also that, that creativity that you see uh, here uh, in a conference to just have a day after to to try and get a little bit of projects going, a little bit of ideas going, people getting together, uh, because that's what State of Map is about, is getting people together. It's nice to meet people on IRC or on mailing list and that kind of thing, but you need to see people. You need to talk people, shake hands, drink coffee, drink beer, drink whatever, uh, but you need to meet those people. And that's what State of Map is for, and that's why I find it completely brilliant uh, to do those things. And, Anyways, we can stimulate those kind of things, uh, and also by having Hack Day on uh, Monday is just, uh, it's just a way of getting, hopefully, the project a little bit further. It's all good fun. And, uh, you're, of course, involved in the OSMF board as well. Uh, yes, I am. And the working groups. Uh, uh, yes. Talk, talk a little bit about the working groups, so we, we want to attract more volunteers into all the different working right. groups. Well, foundation. yeah, it, it's, it's um, the foundation, well, uh, the board is just a couple of people, but one of the the main uh, 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 groups within the foundation are the working groups who, do, who, who just do the grunt work of all the bits to get the, uh, or the, uh, or the organization running. Uh, having a data working group that, that dealing with all kinds of uh, uh, data problems and that kind of thing. We have an or, uh, uh, operational working group that actually just keep, uh, keeps the servers running. A communication working group uh, which, which uh, you're one on local chapters, uh, license. Well, and, it's, and we need to have people who care about these things. And uh, the great thing is, you don't need to be an expert or a, 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 a doctorate in all kinds of things to actually help you. So it, it, it's a great way if you're kind of tired of mapping and want to do a little bit more, uh, then being active in a working group is a great way of getting uh, the, the project uh, going. And it's... Um, yeah, it's, 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 yeah, I would basically sometimes see it's kind of the beating heart of the foundation, not so much the project itself, because if you look at the project as a whole, we need to have the mappers, we need to have all the community do all that great stuff. But if you look at the uh, foundation, uh, having the service running, getting the message out, doing all that, well, I would sometimes boring stuff, but it needs to be done. And, uh, and yeah, we're getting bigger. Uh, we need to have more... Uh, more uh, people, especially uh, also people from all parts of 
uh, the world. We are a global organization, um, and we need to have all those um, those those, those, those uh, uh, feed lines in of uh, information. What's going on in Japan? What's going on in South America? What's going uh, What's going on in U.S. What's going on in Europe? Uh, to actually make that thing uh, growing. So working groups. If if people are interested in doing a little bit more than just mapping. Have a look at the working groups. Uh, you can find information on uh, osmfoundation.org. Um, and uh, and if you don't find a working group that's there, and you see, well, the foundation should definitely look at it. Uh, we're always open for having new, new, working uh, new uh, uh, working groups. So it's and um, uh, uh, it's a great way of doing. It. And basically, state of the map is a working group, just organising the conference. So it's, there's always, uh, there's all kinds of things, uh, all kinds of things, things uh, going on. Right? Yeah, a lot, of, uh, a lot of kind of directing of volunteer effort as well, isn't it? So, uh, right, yeah. See well, directing is also helping. It's, 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 it's uh, like, uh, well, one of those uh, fun, fun uh, things as well, you, uh, you've now ordered uh, uh, t-shirts, well, we do have this official, one. Official open t-shirt. Which is... Uh, Polo shirts. Oh, oh, polo sh oh yeah, oh yeah, no, no, <laughs> yeah, polo shirts because that's it's, it's higher quality and better and that kind of thing. Absolutely. Well, and doing these kind of things, it's it's fun to do. Uh, and if you see people, that is, oh, that's a great thing to have and great thing to do. That's and it, it can be those little kind of things, and that makes it and that makes it fun. That makes it great uh, to do. And that's that's also giving the community itself. Uh, hopefully more kind of unity that they're part of a bigger group uh, because there are people in the background doing the things that you really need, need, need to do or need, uh, needs to be happening. So we've got a presentation tomorrow, haven't we, where we're going to run through the different working groups. Yes, uh, we do. And, uh, it's, uh, really trying to attract more volunteers into the working groups. We need a bit more help with all of these different things. And there is such a wide range of different things that you can get involved in, isn't there? So, um, oh, absolutely. And uh, again, it's not about if you're an expert, uh, just having well, mo well, motivation. Uh, if you have just a, mo a motivation or a feeling for, for uh, things, uh, then it's going to be all right. Uh, like, well, if you don't understand computers, it might not be the right thing to go in an operational working group. Uh, but if you know how to write a little bit, the communication working group is the excellent place. Uh, those kind of things, and, and you don't need to be a star writer because we have other people that can help out. That's yeah. right. Well, you're busy working on the state of the map organization, yes. of course, so I'd better let you get back to it and run around with microphones and this sort of thing. So, uh, well, thank you very much. Thank and you for well, talking to me. Okay, and thank you for uh, making these uh, talks as the communication worker. <laughs> <laughs>